What's up y'all, Walla Moose here, and in today's video, I'm gonna show you five digital products that you can create and sell, even if you have little or no experience. But before I begin, I post here on YouTube weekly with content geared towards the creative and digital entrepreneur, so if you're interested in that, please subscribe, I'd love to have you along for the ride. But without further ado, let's jump in here and get started. Alrighty, so the platform I'm gonna be using to create these digital pieces of content is Canva. And Canva has both a free and paid version, so I do wanna mention a little disclaimer before we get started. Canva has a content licensing agreement, and with their free account, you have access and free license to resell any content within Canva. However, if you have a free account, some of the free accounts don't have access to images or templates that the pro account does, and you won't be able to resell uh, specific things. And so make sure you read the licensing agreement. I'll put it in the description below, but just do your due diligence before um, selling any content um, to make sure you have access to reselling it. But if you have the pro account, you don't really have much to worry about. Everything is free to use and free to resell. So let's get started. The first piece of digital content that you can create using Canva is planners. And if we go over to Etsy, we can see that the digital planner niche is very, very popular. It is very competitive, but there are a lot of people buying it, so that's okay. Now, let's figure out how to create some for yourself in Canva. So within the homepage, we can search different templates and pre-made projects that you can piggyback off of. So under the search, let's do planners and we'll pull up some suggested templates down here. As you can see, there's 9,000 of them, so you have quite a few to choose from. Let's hit see all and we can pull up all the templates. Now, as you're scrolling through here, you'll notice little crowns next to it. Crowns are the pro version. So these are ones that may be locked for the free users that they can't access. And as you scroll through here, if you see one that you really like, like let's say maybe this cleaning schedule right here, if you like it and you're like, hey, I wanna sell a PDF for a cleaning schedule, let me click on it and it will create a new Canva project with that template and you can edit it and do whatever you want to it. So keep in mind, people probably won't buy one page. You wanna add multiple pages. Um, so it's more of a bundle and more of a deal for people to buy. So all you have to do is add page and you can scroll through some of the templates and add some some of the other templates that match. Just keep in mind, the more pages, the more valuable the product is for the user. And then after you do that, all you need to do is go up to share, download, file type, PDF print, and download. And then you have a PDF file that you can go to Etsy, upload your own product, and start selling it just like that. Super easy. Now the second digital product that you can create and sell using Canva are eBooks. And so let's go up to the templates just like before, and instead of planners, let's do eBook. And eBooks are a great way to, a lot of people use them to give away for free to capture emails. Um, it's just like a good enticement to let people know about your content and just um, convert them even further. So like I said, a lot of people use them for emails. Now the eBook templates will be a bit different than the planner templates because they have multiple pages and you can kind of adjust it and make it your own. So I clicked on this one and you can see when I opened it, it actually has, it looks like four or five pages included. So all you need to do is go in, you can change the images using photos and just drag and drop new images, change the text, do whatever you need to make it your own. And the same as before, share, download, PDF standard, and you can start sending it off into the world. Now, number three, I don't I could not believe people actually buy these and that is printable you ready for this quotes I was very surprised that so many people buy printable quotes when you can just find them for free online and print it hang on your wall but people actually do buy it so it doesn't have to be super crazy detailed you don't have to be an artist uh, this one right here it is literally just let it load this quote simple font white background and people buy it for five dollars that's insane and as you can see it's a bestseller the seller has made seven thousand six hundred um, just for these quotes it's crazy so let's go back here and believe it or not it a canva actually has templates for quotes so let's type that and we can scroll through here and see some templates this might be a good one since it's kind of simple look clean it's what's popular now um, so you just create it download it, sell it, all that fun stuff. Now, digital printable number four is checklists and notepads. So just like before, it's getting a bit redundant. I hope you're not getting bored. 
Um, you can do checklists on the templates, find it. Um, with checklists, I would recommend duplicating it probably 25 times, maybe even 50 times. Make a good PDF bundle that people can print off and put in a three ring binder, anything like that. Um, same for notepads. So notepads, just lines on a paper. Uh, people enjoy buying those. You just want to make sure you have some heft to the PDF. So have multiple, multiple pages of these lines for people to print off. And the fifth and final digital product is niche specific bundles. And so what that means is a lot of these templates you can combine and to make hefty bundles. And so people are actually more likely to buy on Etsy if they get 50, 75, 100 pages within that bundle. So I feel like their, their money goes a longer way when you have a lot of pages in this bundle. So niche specific, what does that mean? Um, well, one example is at the time of filming this, school is about to start. So teachers, students, uh, kids going off to college, any bundle related to those. So let's go to like teachers and we can see the templates for teachers. Um, there's weekly attendance, um, there's get to know your teacher, uh, lesson plan, hall pass, weekly checklist. You can combine all these different templates into a teacher bundle that can be really beneficial for teachers. Same for students, uh, maybe do like a, a notepad, checklist, to-do list, school supply list, um, anything student related, anything going to college related. If you have like, if you want to target preppers, you can do like emergency planners. I actually have in my shop, I sell some digital planners and I actually have a emergency binder printable. It's 55 pages and it's $16 and it's one of my best sellers. So even though it's the most expensive one, I found a niche that people enjoy and people really want these emergency binders. So just find your niche, bundle things together, and you should be pretty good. So I hope this video enlightened you on some things that you can do with Canva. Um, there's some things maybe I hadn't thought of until I did some research. I was like, hey, that's a really good idea. So the possibilities for digital products is really endless on Canva. Um, it's just keep in mind it's a very competitive market. So as long as you are consistent, you produce a lot of content and you're passionate about it, um, I hope it works out for you and I hope you enjoy it. If you can think of any I didn't mention in this video, let me know in the comments below. Uh, but that's it for this video. I hope you liked it. Leave a thumbs up, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.